So I've finished both sides of my strap. You'll notice that I left one really long end and one short end and that's because we're going to crochet these two sides together, the top, to join the top. So this is the top. Now we're going to flip them over so that the wrong side is facing us. And then we're going to insert the hook in that first stitch. I guess white wasn't really a great color to use for these videos because you can't see it. Anyways, so we're going to insert the hook in there and hurt, insert the hook on the other side. And then we're going to carefully pull through both and we're just going to do one here then gently through the first side and then gently through the second side nice and loose though we don't want to make it too tight okay you're going to pull it through the back pull it through the front and then we're just going to pull it right through that first the first loop however it works make sure it's nice and loose I don't want it too tight because you want it to have a little bit of give so again through the front through the back wrap your yarn around pull it through both and then through the loop and that's number four And number five. Wrap it around, pull it through, pull it through, and secure it. Let's just grab both these ends and pull them through the loop. Secure, grab your actual working one. Make it nice and tight. You can cut it. We have the size, same size as the other one because we're going to weave in the ends after. And then have a look. Now we have a nice clean top. And we're going to put on the edge now. We're going to weave in all these ends after. Or you guys will. I'll do mine a little bit later, but I don't need to do a video because we've done a video on this before. So now we have our little bag with our handle. So pick a color. I think I'm going to use this green because I like this green. And you're going to find the corner of one of your handles and you're going to insert your hook right at the bottom there. Find my end. There we go. Grab that. Pull it through. And then do chain, tighten it up, and then start working your way around. So you're going to work your way around until you reach this end again. So you're going to go all the way down here, you're going to go all the way around here, you're going to grab the outside of this, you're going to go all the way around the strap until you come back here. Then we're going to turn it around, you're going to insert your hook in this corner and work around this side of the strap. Then you're going to weave in on your ends and you're going to be done. So I'll show you what that's going to look like. 